Hey guys, um, I've been trying to draw, do a drawing video for like the last hour and it's just been really mean to me. So I'm just going to get straight into it. So this is how I draw my characters. I start out with a small circle here. Sorry, quickly moving. And yeah, and I draw a slight, sorry. I'm really professional, I know. Draw a slight egg-like shape. This is how I draw my girl characters or my child characters. Since I usually draw my male characters with like just quick drawing, pointier white chins, since they're usually a lot more serious than my girl characters and child characters. So yeah, sorry, getting rid of. The rubber where he sings. Yeah. So, yep, draw egg oval might shape and draw a few light guidelines to show where it's facing. And I usually draw quite big circles for the eyes since <laughs> that's just how I draw. And eyelashes since this is going to be a girl. And I usually draw one circle, then one smaller circle within that circle for the eyes, like most people would. And I usually just leave it black since it looks weird if I draw, do it another colour since I don't draw highlights because it just looks strange in my style. Few blushes. I usually draw quite round noses and small blush like thing on the nose. This eyes looking terrible. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. I'm so professional. I'm being sarcastic, obviously. Yep. And draw circular, uh, not circular, but a round eyebrow. Well, for the eyebrow, and draw a few eyelashes. And for the mouth, I usually just draw a slight smile. Like, just draw a curved line. Usually, sometimes, well, oh, that was really lispy. <laughs> sometimes I draw another circular, curvy line. It depends on the character really. And draw another circle for the eye. I usually do this, like create a rectangle to show me where that eye was and to help me guide the other eye. I usually start off with this eye. Like if I draw a face draw a face like this, I usually start with the eye right next to the nose since it's easier for me and it gives me a better um, guide for where I'm going to put the other eye and, got to draw. and again I draw another circle and that circle yeah I should have scripted this I know but yeah and the hair I usually draw my characters with hair like either this or this since I'm really uncreative like that but it doesn't go too far to cover the eye but it goes just far enough to touch the eye and with this character my character Minami her hair is quite long so I usually draw the bang then the strand of hair that's right next to her ear and her hair's quite strange it sort of goes there it's got another piece of hair around here and goes like that her hair goes round then in then goes straight out 
Yeah. And now I'm going to, after I've drawn the neck, I'm going to ink it. For me, I usually use a 0 0.8 uni pen, pin, fine line, since I like to give off a strong, like quite heavy line to give it, to make it seem more, with more depth. Usually you got to just draw quick lines, but I press quite hard as well, since I like my lines dark. I like to see my lines, and if I can't, then I just get upset. Well, not upset, but... And this is also a good pen. It's like, if you want to colour things in quickly, it's much easier to do to use the 0 0.8 pen than to use um, the 3 pen. Just draw that. Quickly colour shadow. Sorry, it's a bit quiet now. Um, <laughs> I should have script. I honestly should have script. And I can't find my lid now. <laughs> I'll find it in a minute. Uh, and I usually use the 0 0.3 pen if I can find it. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so unorganised. For this, I'll just quickly use the open eight pen but I usually I usually use the O point three pen if I want to draw quick flashes. And then I usually quickly blow in it to make it dry up quicker. And then I rub out the pencil. My paper isn't the best, as you can tell, but it's cool. I can do with it. I usually go and um, paint or sigh and clean up there, but I do like to do traditional traditional art now and then. Hmm. Yep, there we go. Depending on my which character I usually quickly colour it in but like if they have dark hair but considering the enemy's ginger I don't bother so yeah that's how I draw faces if you want I could do a how I draw and how I draw male faces but well yeah hope you liked it and leave a comment and tell me what I could improve on and such Bye.